Bonjour à tous! Welcome back to my channel and if you're new here, I'm Tiff. I'm an American living in Paris and this week I'm coming to you from Calvi, Corsica. So it's actually our very last day in Corsica. We've been here for seven days. Um, we're actually now just packing up, getting ready to leave. But figured I'd share with you guys all that we've done in our seven days of being in Calvi, Corsica. So we decided to come to Corsica, one, because it was about time for me to get out of Paris, explore another part of France, and also because it was one of the safer places to go in France with all that's going on right now. But it's been an awesome week in Corsica for sure. I'm so glad that we discovered this island. So this island is right in between Italy and France. Um, so the cuisine is very Italian and French inspired as well, which is really cool. But we decided to stay in Calvi because we heard that it was the best spot for first time visitors. And I'm so happy that we did. I mean, the beaches here are amazing. The food is amazing. So I'm so excited to share this trip with you. So starting with day one. So our first day, of course, was our day of travel. For me personally, it was my very first time traveling during the pandemic. So I didn't really know what to expect, but honestly, everything went pretty smoothly. We're going to Corsica. We just got to the airport, getting all checked in. Yay! Can't wait! So this is my first time taking a flight uh, during the pandemic. So far, I mean, so good. Everyone's wearing masks inside. Um, so it seems pretty safe. Uh, we're flying Air France. So let's see, we just got our baggage tags and we're gonna go check in. dropped our bags off, I always get so nervous because I'm literally the queen of overpacking and having overweight bags, but all good. Now headed to security. So we just got on the plane. We literally just sanitized the seat that we're sitting in, the seats in front of us. Um, thankfully, there's no one sitting next to me. So there's a seat in between, which is nice. Um, so yeah, here's to a safe flight. And I'll see you in Just waiting on our bags, and then we'll take a taxi to the hotel. You got what I'm looking for. You got everything that I want. My sugar and gold. Once I got a piece of this ecstasy and heavenly bliss. Give me some more. 
So we just made it to our hotel room and this view is literally everything and more. I'm just so happy to be out of Paris for a little bit. Um, so we're just here for a week, uh, but for me, just needed to be by the water, needed to be out of Paris for a bit. So, so happy to be here. I think we're just gonna wash up. I'm like, ugh, gross from the plane. So I think we're just gonna wash up and then maybe grab some dinner. Give me such a thrilling ride, take the rocket up to the sky. Take me high, let's blow into the universe. We're never coming back down to earth. having lunch at Escal Cafe. It's a pretty cutie little place. We just ordered um, a burger and some chicken satay. Yes, a vacay mode on. I can't get enough of this. Never felt a feeling like this. Now you're mine. Give me some more. Now getting my favorite gelato. So we're exploring on this first day in Corsica. I just saw everyone walking up here, so we're gonna see what the hype is all about. And then on day two, it kind of rained most of the day. We even got caught in the rain walking to the beach. So that day was kind of shot. We just kind of had dinner, called it a day. And then on day three, we decided to take the train to Il Rus, which is another area of Corsica with a beautiful, beautiful beach, um, a really cute town. Um, and that's kind of all that we explored. We were only there for a few hours, but it was a great trip nonetheless. I'm loving Corsica. So today we are going to Il Rus. It's another part of Corsica. And we just made a quick stop at this gorgeous little beach. Oh, I love this. very small beach that was literally right next to our hotel like a 10 minute walk it's called Plage de Roncou um, but I think they may have changed the name but it's just so peaceful super private like we're literally the only people here right now and it's like 12 p.m. so really really cute spot um, I'm kind of thinking of like coming here to meditate like every morning uh, during this trip just because it's so close to our hotel but um, very very nice spot so peaceful and I think we're gonna head to the train to Ilus. Roost. We just got off the train and of course it's super pretty here. The buildings are super colorful and now we are on our way to the beach.
sitting on the beach, we've been sitting on these chairs with the umbrellas, and it's been so nice, guys. Ugh, oh, and this view. So we mainly just came here for the beach and I think we're just going to take another walk through the little town. Um, but it was really nice. The beach is nice. Um, we literally just sat, had a few drinks and relaxed. I fell asleep on the beach. So now we are headed back to the train, back to Calvi. Now doing my favorite thing, getting some ice cream. We even have a Nutella flavor, so I'm totally gonna get that one. Um, we've only been to a few so far, but this one was highly recommended, so let's 